Uh, Chris Chinock here for Display Central at CES 2013 and the TCL booth. Uh, behind me here is a rather large 110-inch uh, display that comes from uh, China Star. This actually was shown, uh, it's a four, uh, 4K display. This was actually shown last year at CES uh, as well. Uh, so there's no particular uh, improvements to this. Uh, now, China Star is a joint venture that's owned about 80 or 85 percent by TCL, with the rest being uh, from Samsung. Uh, Samsung also has a showed a version of this last year uh, as well. Um, so uh, ar around the corner, there's also a couple more um, demonstration demonstration units. Uh, there's uh, a curved uh, UHD uh, LCD TV. Uh, there are also uh, some o two OLED uh, panels over there, a 30.5-inch uh, and a 55-inch. Uh, those are also made by, uh, by China Star, so I'm assuming that has uh, uh, Samsung technology uh, behind that. Uh, very, uh, very little information available on, on both of those panels. Uh, looks like they may or may not be available in China, but certainly no news about availability here in the, uh, in the U.S. Uh, they have some demos in this uh, rather large cube they have set up here. Uh, one shows white color gamut um, that goes to 104% of, uh, of NTSC. Uh, the other was an upscaling uh, for a 4K TV from a, from a 1080p signal, uh, which looked fine. Uh, and the other was a motion compensation circuit, which actually looked not very good at all. I'm not quite sure why they would, would be showing that. Uh, perhaps the more important demo uh, was around the corner. Um, it was a, a Dolby Vision demo. And now, this, this demo is not very compelling, I have to tell you, um, because the peak brightness and the color gamut are not particularly, uh, uh, the p peak brightness is only about 400 nits, so it doesn't look much different than, a, than an ordinary UHD TV. And it wasn't clear what the color gamut was. Again, no specs available uh, at this point. Uh, so that's uh, that's pretty much the story from TCL at this point. Uh, Chris Chinock for Display Central.